Hey, what's going on? Can't yeah, make a video. It's been a while. Um, you know, I I've been doing the Twitch, and uh, it's been a lot of fun. It really has. Doing a whole bunch of artwork, and you know, just getting making people feel better and happy about like how I edit and uh, do things. It's very hard to people please. I know we live in a world right now where it's all chaos and uh, kind of destructive. And uh, you know, I mean. I'm not the master of social media, if that's what people are aiming at. I just, you know, I love putting myself out there. I don't have a problem with it. I'm not afraid. To, I'm not afraid to get out of my own skin and share. Um, now, I got a group on Facebook that's all about dreadlocks, and I got over 6,000 people in that group, which is a huge number. Now, when I share this video and it goes up. Tell me how many of you guys have dreads and po try and post a picture because I'd like to see that. It's interesting. You know, I, I'm intrigued. I honestly love seeing new things and it makes me feel happy. You know, I've been rolling this out for like seven years. Ain't looking to get rid of them, but um, there are times when I feel like the shower, uh, showering every other day isn't really the best. You know weighs your head down a little bit, but, uh, we're getting places, you know, I, uh, how can I start? Well, I've just been working on myself, you know, it's very difficult to, um, work for other people, and, like, sometimes we don't know where to begin, um, so I, you know, I do my own thing, and people leave me alone, that's, like, the best part of everything, really. And uh, I'm in a room, of course. I'm in a room where I have a lot of things going on. People might not understand why. And uh, it's definitely questionable. Like, what is this guy up to? What is his motive? What does he want to represent? And um, to be quite honest with you, it's a little bit of a roller coaster. You know, I brought all the stuff that I've ever had since childhood along for the ride. And, uh, you know, I mean. It's only it's only getting better and I'm, I'm very happy you know I'm very happy with who I've become and uh, what direction I'm aiming towards because sometimes you get stuck in the um, in the in the fog light and, uh, yeah you know I mean not a lot of people know Scott and, you know, I used to be a church goer I love church I love people of worship nothing against no one that has something to do with the Lord there's just a lot of things going on in the world world right now, and it's very uh, arguable. And uh, you know, I mean, it kind of makes makes me itch. But what are you gonna do, right? Only one person can change the world. And uh, look what look what Walt Disney did. You know, look what Steve Jobs did. Look what um, all these small businesses you know all these people that are trying to rise up and do things for themselves look what they're doing and it's like you know it's very inspirational it really is and um i think i'm headed in that direction you know of like entrepreneurship or like advertising and because i I've, I've hit many rock bottoms i'm not gonna lie i've had a dark side i've had ghosts follow me for like the last few years and I'm just trying to like you know get out of that I was I wasn't being real when I said ghosts I was just like a figure of speech you know I've had people defriend me befriend me whatever you want to call I've had people add me and want to know more about me and you know it's just interesting how people come and go and uh Yeah, I, I mean, I'm on a journey, and I'm not over it, you know, I'm still doing this. I'm still doing the whole YouTube shebang, and uh, I'm sure people could agree that it's some sort of, like, therapy. And, uh, it really is, like, for people that don't understand, YouTube is very therapeutic. There's many information to look for, and, uh... I'm not going to say what you already don't know. 
let's just, you know, I mean, it comes to a point in life where you just, you want to quit sometimes, but you know you can't. Let me put my glasses on. I'm starting to fog up here in my eyes. I got the glasses. I'm sorry about that. Sometimes my eyes get blurry, and uh, you know, it's just it's just how it, just how it goes sometimes. You know, you gotta put the glasses on. Um, you know, I'm getting old. I'm almost 30 years old, guys. Still living at home. And the thing about me is, I'm just very afraid. I'm very afraid of the unexpected. I've always been that way. And uh, sometimes I don't know what way I want to go, which is terrifying. It really is. It's terrifying. And I'm just trying to make light of everything. And uh, this ain't a therapy session. This is just me being me. I could talk all day, right? No, I'm probably going to stay on here for another minute or two and just end it, you know. Um, you know, I love gaming, I like editing, I love doing a whole bunch of different things that require um, hand-eye coordination. And uh, I, I love a challenge. I, I really do, I love a challenge. And if I could become something better than how I am now, I would definitely take it and run. Um, it's just very, very difficult right now. We live in a world of chaos. That's not an excuse. Many things go wrong, and uh, I don't want to be in the midst of that, you know. I don't want to be in the midst of that. I just want to be where I, where, where I want to be. I want to ground myself and just stay planted, you know, like a tree. And... Uh, you know, I hope everyone just is staying blessed, safe, and healthy, man. That's all I really care about. I just, I, I, I've become one with the Lord where I haven't really read the Bible, but I know much about it to actually talk about it, you know. I wish everyone has success. I hope everyone is happy. I hope everyone can have a chance to do something to change the world and make it a more positive place. You know, there's just, just too many things are going on right now, man. We got this whole COVID shit going on, the Ukraine. You know, prayers out to them. They didn't really do anything wrong, I don't think. Um, I don't keep up with the news. I'm like under a rock. What the hell is this? Oh. You know, I really don't open up the newspaper. I hear about things and I just kind of report it. And, uh... It's sad, man. It really is. Families are being killed. Little children are being shot. Um, wow, man. Like, that speaks a volume. And I just hope everyone, everyone one day could just have world peace. No, I'm not a hippie, man. Really, I'm not. I don't even smoke weed. I don't smoke. I don't drink. Never drank a day in my life. Lord be my judge. I only drink Monster, bro. That's like my alcohol, alright? And I have a can collection, okay? Don't laugh at me. <laughs> I know people are going to be snot, snot, <laughs> I can't pronounce it. <laughs> oh my god. Well, it is what it is, man. It really, you know, it sucks the world has to go like this. You know, we, we obviously there are things we want to say. But the megaphone ain't really that loud enough to spread it everywhere. I mean, you got people that don't even know what's going on right now. And that's sad. It really is. It's sad. We live in a time of death where it's accepted to die. You know, like, it's just... It's a shame, bro. It really is. I mean, I hope the second coming gets here really soon. Because we need something to happen right now. And I'm not going to, you know, to see people die like this, man. It's just crazy. It's like survival of the fittest. And whoever could keep up with the race, you know, like. It's almost like Fall Guys. If you ever heard of that game, oh boy. That gets me stressed. 
So yeah, guys, I'm probably gonna end the video here. I don't want to go on all night. Um, I know people got shit to do, and uh, I just hope everyone can just be happy and you know do what they like to do that's positive and just just stick with it, man. Really, if you need someone to talk to, always you know try looking for groups on Facebook, man. People, there's groups everywhere. There's there's just everything, you know. That's what the world has come to everything. Where we just sit inside and you go like that and everything's there. And uh, I'm very lenient on it, but you know, at the same time, it's obviously accepted. I'm a little bit of a computer whiz. I'm not a hacker or anything like that. I just know a little bit more about things than other people do. I know how to f turn a picture into a, a masterpiece, if you will. But yeah, guys, I mean, I hope everyone just stays blessed and just, you know, just take a, a breath of fresh air tomorrow and just say, you know what, today's going to be a good day. And uh, if it's not, try again, ne try again next time or tomorrow or the day after, you know. All right, I'm ending this. Peace out.